Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen Wa salatu wa salamu ala ashrafil mursaleen Sayyidina wa nabiyyina Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam Wa ala alihi wa ashabihi ajma'in Amma ba'd Assalamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala He says in the Holy Quran Hunna libasun lakum wa antum libasun lahum That the women are a libas A garment unto the men And that the men are a garment unto the women. Subhanallah, what a word Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has used. Libas, a garment. Why has Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala used this word libas? What is the function of, of clothing? Why do, we, why do people wear clothing? People wear clothing for various purposes or various functions. They wear clothing to protect their private parts, to guard their modesty, if a person has a scar or a shortcoming or a mark on his or her body, then they will wear clothing to cover that shortcoming, to cover that scar or to cover that mark. And in summer, for example, when it is very hot, we wear lighter clothing. And in winter, when it is very cold, we wear thicker clothing. Clothing best suited to combat the cold, to combat sicknesses, to protect us from getting sick. Likewise, the relationship between the husband and the wife should be like that of clothing. They should be a means of covering for one another. The husband and wife should cover the faults of one another. If the wife or husband has a shortcoming, then don't disclose it for the whole world. Don't let everybody know the shortcomings of your husband or wife, but rather as a husband or a wife or a couple, you must cover the faults of your husband or the wife. Be like that of clothing. Protect one another. Through sicknesses and health. Through good times and bad times. And more importantly, become a couple that becomes more conscious of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. وَمَا تَوْفِيكِ إِلَّا بِاللَّهِ وَآخِرُ دَعْوَاهُمْ عَنِ الْحَمْدُ لِلَّهِ رَبِّ الْعَالَمِينَ